new anointing. Hallelujah. You are only as good as the church that ordains you and anoints you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. See, if you go and get and somebody who's doing something else lay hands on you, good luck with that ministry. Hallelujah. But this is a sanctified ministry filled with the Holy Ghost and we are empowered by the Holy Ghost to anoint her and to ordain her this day. Hallelujah. That she will walk in her calling that God will uh, uh, definitely use her mightily in this generation. Hallelujah. The devil is ordaining his children. Hallelujah. God is also ordaining his ministers. Hallelujah. We bless God this morning. Word of God, I anoint you this morning in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. And we're just going to have Brother Mike read for us this scripture. 1 Peter 5, verse 1 through 4. Nice and the elders which are among you I exhort, who am also an elder and a witness of the suffering of Christ, and also a partaker of the glory that shall be revealed. Feed the flock of God which is among you, taking the oversight thereof, not by constraint, but willingly, not for filthy lucre, but of a ready mind. Neither as being lords over God's heritage, but being ensembles to the flock. And when the chief shepherd shall appear, you shall receive a crown of glory that fadeth not. Hallelujah. Father, in the name of Jesus, we anoint her by the power of the Holy Ghost. By the power and the extra anointing invested in this church, the river of life of North Fargo, Lord, we will anoint her and we ordain her into the ministry of Jesus Christ. Amen. You said, God, that you anointed Jesus Christ with the Holy Ghost and power. I pray as she arrives, she will arise to a new day. God, a blameless minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ. That God, that she will not be Lord over your people, but she will walk as an example of God. Lord, I pray extra anointing upon her life, that God, and no weapon form against her shall prosper. There is now, therefore, no condemnation in her life. And Lord, as she come forth, oh God, may she come forth with authority and power. Lord, I thank you for her life as she arrives. She arrived as the minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ. Amen. Father, we bless you for her. Thank you. In Jesus' name, let the church say, Amen. 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 So, Mr. Johnson, arise and speak to your people. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen.
Hallelujah. In Jesus' mighty name. That was just the introduction of the presence of God. We try to bring the Spirit of God down. Amen. That His Spirit, His Spirit's already with us. But we have to activate that which is in us. Amen. So we become.